Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. And of course, guys, today I'm going to show you with the iPhone. And this applies to any iPhone. I'll be demonstrating on the iPhone 11 how to fix the issue where um, Instagram, you're getting an Instagram login error. And this is specifically for the iPhones. All right, so let's get straight into it. All right, so let me just unlock this device. And of course, the error. I'm going to put up a screenshot on screen to show you what it looks like. Um, if you're getting this error and trying to log in, just note that this is one of the most common errors that you can find on Instagram. And of course, there are several reasons why this might be happening for your device. So one of the main ones, we're going to look at them. I have six varied solutions that should work for just about any situation. So let's take your time and let's roll through them one by one until we find a working solution to fix your problem. All right, so the first one is going to involve finding the Instagram app. So I want to find the Instagram app in cases where you cannot um, log in as you're getting that consistent error. And of course, it goes without saying that make sure that your password and so on is correct. And these are just some quick double checks before um, you proceed with my tips. So make sure you're um, inputting the correct password. Make sure your internet and all that is working as it should and so on. And those are just some bases. In a few cases, it might just be that you have overlooked something, including not being connected to the internet. Or of course, um, you made a mistake with a spelling error or so on with the login credentials. All right. And the first step after making those basic checks, um, the first thing I want to do, and this is tip number one, you're going to go ahead, guys, in this case, and you're going to delete the app. I know you might have heard this already, or you might think to yourself, you have tried this. This is going to be a little bit different so just go ahead find the instagram app since you're on iphone we're going to long press and of course you have the option there to delete the application all right so in that case you just go ahead and hit delete of course i'm not going to do it on this device i'm just basically running through the steps and of course once you delete next all right so once you delete the application guys and this is the difference instead of going straight ahead again after the app is um, deleted totally does simply wait 24 hours now of course 24 hours is a long period to wait but of course you need to wait just a while until the application is removed from your phone totally do not install it right away just leave your phone for a day or so i know it's going to be hard but of course um, just put on the phone for 24 straight hours once the 24 hour period is up you're going to go back to the um, app store and of course You should be on the home feed simply go over to search you're going to search for instagram and this is after 24 hours you're going to find and of course in your case it should say get instead of open you're going to hit get and of course when it's finished you're going to go ahead and hit open now of course the 24 hour wait is the key in getting back your account in some cases and those who are having this particular issue waiting the 24 hours was the key to getting back your account instead of simply uninstalling, reinstalling your um, app right away. So in some cases, doing that should give you the boost you need to get back your account. Next, which is our second tip, um, you're gonna go ahead, and this one involves the app itself. So I'm just gonna go ahead and open up the application. All right, so you're gonna go ahead and launch um, Instagram. You should be at the login screen. You're just gonna enter your username, as you can see here, that's mine. And instead here, you're just going to go and you're going to enter the password. So just simply go in and place in your password. And of course, it must be the correct password. Please do not use my um, username. That will not help you. Use your account username and of course, your unique password. Now, of course, the key tip here for this particular step, instead of going in and trying to log in where you'd actually get the error, this time you're going to do something a little bit um, different. So um, this time, what you're going to end up doing is that you're going to hit forget our forgotten password. Now, of course, forgotten password here, when I tap it, it's going to bring you to this screen here. And of course, once you're here, you should be seen. So once you're here, what you're going to do from here is you're going to input your username. You're going to follow the wizard. And of course, I do not need to go through all of this. It's straightforward. Simply place in your information, such as your username. It will guide you and send 
the reset password back to your email and of course you're going to reset your password by entering the code on your device and your um, password will be changed and of course you should be able to log in after changing um, your password and key information here once once you're able to reset your password and log in, make sure you do not change anything for 24 hours. So as soon as you reset your password and if you're able to get back in, do not change anything at all. Do not edit your name. Do not change any links. And of course, once you do that, um, you should be good. After 24 hours, you can go back through and change anything you like. All right. So just remember that key step there. That's key. If you try to change anything, um, you might run into um, issues. Step three. Um, if you're having um, the same error, make sure that you use another device. It doesn't really matter. It could be another iPhone. It could be any other device that you have handy. It could be a, a friend's device. So simply use another device. And once you have a secondary device, just go ahead and log in or try to log in. Most times on a secondary device, you should be able to log in. And for some reason, in that case, it might be just that that particular device that you're using might be blocked for some reason or causing the errors as the issue itself is within the device. So just go ahead and borrow a friend's device or somebody else around the house and use their device and try to log into your account using the same credentials from before. I think that might work um, as a workaround as well is that you might be able to use your built-in browser and log in so try using a different device such as on your computer or of course on the or on the current device that you're on so just go ahead and launch the internet then of course you're going to go to um, instagram.com and just um, to make sure that your account is not um, banned or someone you can try logging in from here so what you can do from right here is just go ahead into your credentials once you enter your credentials um, just go ahead and hit log in once you log in one of the fun things is that sometimes you might be surprised that it just goes ahead and logs log you into your account within the browser while it's not logging you into the application that's always a good sign when you're able to log in to um, the um, the at least the browser now of course if you can't log into the app or into the browser chances are your account might just be blocked or banned the fifth step is to wipe your device of course it's always a good idea to back up your device and of course in wiping your device do be warned that you will lose all your data um, to show you how to go about wiping your device make sure you're in settings as seen here um, next we're going to go down to general once you're in general, you should see a bunch of options, but all the way at the bottom here, you should see the option to um, reset. Go ahead and hit reset. And of course, what you're going to do is you're going to do a total reset. Notice there are several options. The one you want to go for is reset, or sorry, erase all content and settings. Now, of course, this will return your device to a factory state. And of course, it's the second option on the screen. So go ahead and erase all content and settings and restore your device to a fresh state so just hit that it will run through the process and of course once you're finished do not restore your device any at all um, as some cases why the error is happening is that your device is corrupted especially if in the past you are accustomed to restoring your device what cannot miss that um, files over time can be corrupted and due to the restoring are you restoring your device it results in whatsapp not working as it should thus the current login error so do not restore anything. Of course, you can connect your iCloud and restore your photos, but that's about it. Do not restore any settings or carry over anything from your other device. Set it up as if it's the first time you're using your device and it should fix the issues now. Of course, this is one that does work and work well. So you may want not to want to rule this one out. You may want to leave it anti as your last option, but of course, make sure that you do that one way. Erase, do not restore um your um from a backup but of course you can connect your iCloud to set up your device like a brand new device fresh out of the box without restoring anything at all all right doing that should work in most cases now of course the final step which is um the sixth step which is the final tip it involves um your device 
and of course you'll need a secondary device and this one only works if you are able to log in on a secondary device on your secondary device we can imagine that or just pretend right now that this is the secondary device and what you want to do on the secondary device is simple and of course here's what you're going to do first thing um you're going to log in on a secondary device so you should be in your account as seen here you're going to go to your profile now of course once you're on your profile on your secondary account you're going to go in here which is into um settings and forgive me for a bit here you're going to tap once you're in um settings here you're going to go to um the option that says you're going to go into the option again that says account once you're in account next go to um linked account now once you're in linked account let's go ahead and see what which um is connected if you have none connected here's what you're going to do um you're just simply going to do as shown here um if there's one there go ahead and tap and remove once you remove you're going to create a new or fresh facebook account and of course once you create a fresh facebook account you're going to link that right in here on the secondary device now once you link your um, account with the new login and credentials with a fresh facebook account you can go ahead and log off to off that secondary device and you're going to go back to your original phone again we're going to pretend this is now the original phone and right at the login screen instead of logging with your password you're going to log in with that new facebook account and what should happen in some cases is that by using the new facebook account to do the fresh login right now what should happen is that it should let you in on your main device or your usual device in to your account and of course um, in some cases that too should work now of course guys it's a very complicated problem another thing that you might want to bear in mind is that the um, guys over at um, Instagram might be having server issues now of course server issues for Instagram is a very big thing so you can simply go online and um, do a random check to see if um, the search if Instagram is having issues today and of course the headlines should come up indicating whether or not they have a um, issue today of all days um, so you want to watch out for that but usually if it's a long-term occur occurrence for you um, in those cases you might want to try the steps that we have given here and of course i think i've covered all or basically almost all the possibilities and again guys remember if you did anything um, illegal or against the terms of service you could be banned and in a case that you're banned or blocked the only way you can um, get back your account is to appeal to instagram so you'd have to contact instagram tell them your username and of course explain your situation and maybe if they are feeling very merciful they'll allow you to regain access to your account so that's about it guys so that's it for the iphone and the login base error that you might be seeing on your screen when trying to log in all right guys we got a corner from block tech tips with a very detailed and long um tutorial on how to fix this problem on the iphone bye guys